At Care Patron, we are constantly looking at ways to improve. If you have any feedback on how we can improve our videos and platform, please leave us a comment in the comment section below. When you're exhausted and overwhelmed, the last thing you want is to trek across town to see your psychiatrist for a session. But what if you could access the support and care you need right from the comfort of your own home? Through telepsychiatry. Telepsychiatry is like bringing your therapist or psychiatrist right to your doorstep virtually. It's a form of telemedicine that utilizes telecommunications technology to provide mental health services remotely. It is having a therapy session via video call or chatting with your psychiatrist through a secure messaging platform. Telepsychiatry is not just about convenience. Sharma and Devon assist the effectiveness of telepsychiatry post COVID 19, identifying 325 papers and five key themes, including patient and clinician satisfaction, diagnostic reliability, outcomes, technology, and professional guidance. Results indicate that telepsychiatry shows promise with consistent diagnostic reliability and satisfactory outcomes, but its full potential is hindered by clinician reluctance and a lack of professional guidance. Telepsychiatry is valuable for providing mental health care, allowing psychiatrists to effectively diagnose, treat, and support individuals with mental health disorders, regardless of geographical barriers. As technology advances, telemental health services will likely play an increasingly crucial role in delivering mental health services. Psychiatrists practicing telepsychiatry typically need a few critical pieces of equipment to conduct remote sessions effectively. A computer or laptop, webcam, microphone, headset or speakers, a secure telehealth platform, electronic health record system, and a digital pen and tablet. Here are six methods that psychiatrists can practice to conduct their work effectively through a telehealth platform. Video conferencing. Using video conferencing software, a psychiatrist can conduct live face-to-face -face sessions with their patients. Secure messaging. Secure messaging platforms enable psychiatrists to communicate with their patients asynchronously. Telephone consultations. Telephone consultations provide a convenient and accessible way for psychiatrists to connect with patients who may not have access to video conferencing technology or prefer audio-only communication. Virtual group therapy. Through video conferencing software, psychiatrists can facilitate virtual group therapy sessions, bringing together multiple patients for peer support, psychoeducation, and therapeutic interventions. Remote monitoring. With wearable devices, smartphone apps, and remote monitoring tools, psychiatrists can track patient symptoms, behaviors, and treatment adherence outside scheduled sessions. To learn more about telepsychiatry, go to our care patron website or click on the link in the description. We have a range of guides and articles to help you learn more about different therapy techniques to incorporate into your practice. Care Patron is a healthcare platform designed for you. Signing up is free. Just click on the link in the description. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button for more content like this.